live? You ready? All right, everybody. What's up, man? It's your boy, Lowe's Cut It, and you're in the cut with today's guest, who a lot of people out there do not know, never seen his face. This is actually the first time I get to meet him, and very talented dude. He goes by the name of Mastermind Photo on Instagram, and check him out. Well, how, how do you spell your name, first of all, before you... Uh, it's just Mastermind Photo, one word? Oh, uh, yeah. Bet. So shout out to the homie Brian, who's that's his real name, but everybody calls him Mastermind Photo, and he's the first official guest for the podcast, and we're going to talk about today's shoot and what we're going to be doing. So what's up, dude? What's the word? <laughs> welcome, to, welcome to the podcast, man. First, Thank first, you for uh, me, bro. First one ever. Yeah. Well, um, shit, I'm excited to be here, bro. I'm excited to see what you're doing for the community and for just everybody in general in this dope. industry. Uh, I think this is dope, bro. So I'm super excited to kill it today and show everybody, you know, kind of the way that I shoot. And um, they get more in depth with knowing who I am and shit. You know, things pretty dope, cool. man. And I, I appreciate you letting us capture your flow for the academy I got going on. And obviously appreciate you being a part of this podcast and being the first one, being a Chicago artist to kind of put your work out there. And I also want to introduce you guys to my homie, Callie over here, who's another savage entrepreneur who does everything from barbering, videography, photography. I mean, he's an electrician. He, <laughs> what doesn't this kid do, man? And one I stop swear, shop. Swear, he, he's the man behind this whole, uh, like everything you see as far as the cameras, the sound. He's helped. He helps me out with a lot. He's, one of two of the guys that films for my uh, academy. So if you're wondering why my academy videos have two different vibes and two different looks, is because I get I have two different uh, videographers doing that. So, Kelly, what's up, brother? Well, let's see, man. I'm very happy to be here, by the way. I'm excited to meet you again, Appreciate even though we met. It. Appreciate it. You're so crazy. Savage. You're talented as hell, bro. Yeah, I don't like, gasp. <laughs> it is, it's the Savage. truth, you know what I mean? Creative. I'm I'm like, you know, like you're just one of the best that I've seen, you know, when it comes to creativity. Yeah, bro. Dude, you your work is phenomenal. And that's kind of what we're gonna talk about today, man. A lot of people who aren't familiar with who you are. Obviously, I come we come from a world of barbering. So a lot of people that know who we are are mostly barbers. Yeah. And I'm sure you're pretty well known in the whole photography world. So this is our way to kind of introduce you to the barbering world. And one thing that I noticed about your work is eye catching. It's I can It's definitely something that if I click on your page and I see your work, it's gonna yeah. be like, whoa, who is this guy? Yeah. Hey, that's exactly what I was thinking. You know what I mean? Like yeah. your, your work, it varies, man. It varies from outside shoots, from inside shoots, from um, flash photography to regular um, using outside lighting, natural lighting, like your editing, your creativity, the models you work with, from this whole demonic look and feel to very <laughs> sexy, sexy, sensual shoots with females, like you. You literally capture it all, man. You don't just have one look. And that's kind of what I admired about you. And when I started following you, I was like, I couldn't believe how sick it was. And it was crazy to find out that you knew who Kelly was and yeah, yeah. how yeah. I, I worked with David. And David works with you a lot. And it's just a lot of a crazy small world, man. And once again, it's dope to meet you. And what do you what do you think of the setup, man? You, like, what do you this overall? Is, give me your opinion on this. I think this is sick. It's <laughs> giving me very like Godfather cartel vibes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm up with it. I think this is dope. And uh, I'm grateful to be here, man. And I'm grateful for everybody's like endless support that they give me in Chicago, and other places that I've traveled to that I've done work, you know, in other spots. I mean, I'm just really grateful, man, because this is something that. I didn't even have an interest in ever in my life. Like it just kind of landed on my lap and I just kind of took it and ran with it. And next thing you know, it's a career. So I just, Dude. in the blink of an eye, I'm like, when the hell did I even- When I become a photographer? Yeah, yeah when, yeah, bro. Yeah. Cause I swear in high school, like I would see people with cameras and I'd be like, fucking loser. Like Peter, yeah, Park, yeah. Peter Parker has- <laughs> For, how, did, how did it happen though? How did it happen? <laughs> so <laughs> my uh, <laughs> my pops, he, yeah. was, he was a photographer back in his day, but he would just take pictures of like the city, you know, us as kids and stuff like that yeah and um he bought a camera i was really good at photoshop like in the myspace days mm -hmm. so pretty much i'll just like be pimping out people's pictures uh. you know making party flyers juke flyers you know all that wow. stuff and uh my dad he came up to me one day and he's like um 
hey, uh, you know, if you had a more expensive camera, your edits will look better because the quality would be better. Mm-hmm. I'm like, man, that shit is lame. I will never in my life ever be doing that type of stuff, for, you know, photography. That's wild, yeah. He bought the camera, and one day I just picked it up, man. I would just take pictures of, like, my sisters because all my sisters are real beautiful. And I'll just edit them, you know. I'll just be editing their eyes, you know, just stuff like that. My pets, cousins. And slowly but surely, I'll take it to school. And next thing you know, bro, I'm just like shooting people in school, you know, after yeah. school, just Left in the parking right. lot. Yeah. And oh, yeah. then I don't know, it just, I made an Instagram and I don't know, the passion just took over, I guess. But uh, yeah. I do art too, um, aside of this. So yeah. I do paintings and stuff. Wow. So if you look at my paintings, it's the same as my photography, the same colors, Wild. the same, cr- super crazy, bro. Like yeah, my paintings you know? are super weird, you know, like third eyes. And I like all that spiritual stuff. So that I kind of mixed my photography with my artistry and that's how I got my style I guess that's oh, yeah. crazy for what it is it's you know? unique man it's, it's, crazy it's unique. unique because you do it all bro hey, yeah. like I, if I could sit here and be like hey mess man I need a high key photo where it looks like everything's bright and white in yeah. heaven like you're in heaven you can create your own look and identity mm-hmm. to that or if I want something de- demonic, something dark, <laughs> moody, yeah. you can do that. Or if I want to, yeah. hey, I want to capture a family portrait, right. you can do that. And there's not a lot of people that are good at all of that. It's people trying to yeah. turn things so mad. That's why I had to meet you. And, and we're collaborating today. For those of you guys that don't know, the reason why Mastermind is here is because we're doing a collab. And we have our motto. So instead of me telling you guys what we're going to do, man, I'm going to let Mastermind explain exactly what we're going to be doing. The type of um, shot he's looking for, the type of edit he's going to do. And then... Uh, once he finishes with that, I'm going to share with you guys a couple things that I feel about for those of you that don't know anything about photography, that want to get a better understanding about photography. I'm going to talk about different photographers in different ways and then how obviously mastermind shoots. So what's going on today? What are we working on with today? So uh, today I'm shooting Mark since day one. He's like my main, you know, model that I work with. We do the most sickest concepts together i feel like uh just because he's an artist and i'm an artist both of our artistries mix and i don't know we just both i guess shooting together just came together with this like dark natural eh? dark demonic well you know what's crazy is like i'm like a man of the lord you know what i mean i like that whole light stuff and but every time me and him talk like i tell him like i don't know what it is about when i photograph you like you bring the dark side out of my edits and that it kind of became an aesthetic in my stuff where I kind of liked incorporating that kind of stuff. So today we're going to do, um, he's going to be like red, like the devil, you know, pretty much. And, um, the backside of him is going to be coming out him of his own face, but like an angel. So I'm going to have like the halo on top of him, but the devil, you know, here. So it's kind of like, a, it's more of a meaningful message. A lot of my stuff that I do with him, I feel like it's more, um, it's more in depth about art and about, you know, stuff like that. And I feel like this picture is really going to just show what we all go through, like that transcending duality of like, we're all good and evil, all of us, every single person in this world. So I feel like, uh, it's a message that everybody can relate to through art and photography and your haircut. So, you yeah, know, yeah, it's just going to be, be fun. And it's dope because that's how yeah. I'm going to be a part of it is by cutting the man's hair. And actually, we got David in the building now, man. We might as yes, well. Sir. Yes, sir. You guys sir. know him as Mark <laughs> since day one. He's a phenomenal model, man. And we're going to do his podcast and hopefully soon. I know he's a busy guy, but we're going to try to get him in here and share his story. But, Dave, come on out here, man. We got, we got it. Like, right now, he's in full wardrobe. Yeah. And just kind of get behind, get next to Cali and look, check this guy out. <laughs> he, I'm not going to let him say anything because a lot of people don't know what he sounds like until we do his podcast. But you can see he's in full wardrobe after this podcast. We're going to go into the studio and we're going to we're gonna capture these shots. Now, if you're interested and you want to know exactly what kind of sh- how these are going to look, just go to loscutter.com. We're going to have a special video just on how Mastermind shoots the, the whole shoot. And speaking of shooting, I, I do want to address, there's people out there that don't know anything about photography that are just now trying to get familiar with the same thing with with barbering a lot of people are just now be, like oh all, all of a sudden they want to buy clippers and cut hair yeah, because yeah, yeah. they're starting to realize with this pandemic and everything going on they're starting to realize like damn i need to make my own money i can't rely on people so i i'm starting to see people become models now people are st- starting to become photographers videographers and all this cool stuff of people like us that have been doing it for a while we can <clears throat> we can spot the difference in the type of photographers and videographers that they are. And I want to let you guys know that there's people that I've worked with that are all about being technical, knowing everything there is to know on a camera, 
how to shoot. And their goal is to capture the perfect shot so they don't have to go do any edits on Photoshop to do very minor, minor edits. And I feel like the way I became a better photographer, and I don't even like to refer myself as a photographer. I'm just a barber that nah, knows you how to are. take. you be killing I just know how to take cool photos because yeah, I, right? took the, I took a long time to figure it out. But Mastermind, he's the type of photographer, when I had a conversation with him, he told me that he just captures simple shots and it's all in the editing. So I'm excited to see how he actually shoots, his settings, his setup, how David poses, and then we're going to share with you guys in the exclusive video the actual photo that he created off that shoot. So you get a visual on how he actually does it, which I'm assuming is a VIP exclusive <laughs> only because I don't think anyone's ever really recorded you doing no, a shoot, right? No, 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 not really. No. So yeah, shout out to Kelly for being a part of this because he's going to be hey, capturing thank you, that. Thank you, man. And uh, I know, dude, I mean... What do you got to say? Are you excited to see? I'm excited to see uh, how man, you shoot. Man, I'm crazy excited. You know, I, I always be messaging, him, man, bro, you go hard, this and that. Like, I want to see. I want to see how it goes down. Oh, I'm man, excited, bro, because you know that shot with the girl with the Skittles? Like, mm. yeah. with the eyes, with Alita, the color. Bro, yeah. Yo, that was sick. That was sick, man. That was one of my favorite it's so, shots. It's so vivid and so clean and so, like, thank detailed, you, bro. bro. Thank you, thank so you. So little things thank like you. that, man. Yeah, and then yeah. The, while we have you on here... Guys, so you guys are watching this. This is not playing. While we have Mastermind on here, I was talking mm -hmm. to Callie about how me and him are barbers, but we had to learn photography. We had to learn videography because it's hard when you rely on people to do your work. And sometimes when you do stuff and you, and you let other people shoot your videos or shoot your photos, it can, one, take time, and two... It'll it'll take forever to get your stuff back, and when you do, you're, you're going to want to tweak some things in here and there. So by us learning this stuff... It's cool because we understand it, but it sucks because we stretch ourselves out. So now we can't focus on the one thing we're really good at, which is hair. Yeah. So Mastermind, um, I met you. You seem like a cool dude. Heard none great things about you. you David bro. talks highly of you. Kelly talks Thank highly you. of you. And <laughs> my, you. my proposition for you is, dude, if you want to somehow collaborate in the sense of where we kind of expand your audience, I want to see if there's a way where we can kind of do something once a month, either with me, with Kelly, where we provide models. We, we can... Um, do a six shoot where you focus on the photos. I can focus on the hair. Right. Callie could do a video for us. And now mm -hmm. it goes in a circle. Yeah. Uh, and yeah. that way you get content you and he gets content. I get yeah. content. And it, it becomes a thing where you can still do what you do. Right. But now you just expand the, your audience by messing yeah. with me and Callie. Where do I no, sign? <laughs> <laughs> so we got digital contract. What's up? Right. 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 So Let me get my, my, my goal for that is, it, is I love your style, man. You have Thank a lot you, of man. great things that I don't know anything about. I don't know how to shoot outside. Everything I've learned was all in-studio lighting. So I see that your shots are outside, inside, out. So you, you're very creative with that. If I can plan models and, and Callie could plan a model and we do a sick-ass haircut on that, I could focus on the one thing that I'm really good at and then mm -hmm. send them your way or you could meet us up the same day like we are here right, right. and you capture the shot. And that yeah. becomes content for yourself. Yeah, I think that's amazing, that's bro. That's the same for us. Yeah, yeah. And I think that's just going to be something that... It'll help everybody in yeah. No, so, no, man, no. I'm, I'm glad you yeah, said that. No, yeah, hell yeah. I appreciate <laughs> it, bro. Yeah. I, appreci I really, really appreciate it, man. I feel like... Uh there's nothing better than support in this industry, you know what I mean? And there's a lot of people that don't support, you know, y'all y'all know who you are. But, yeah. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but real, you bro. guys know firsthand, yeah. being at the caliber you guys are at, there's a lot of people that they don't want to see you win in here, you know what I'm saying? There's yeah. enough money for everybody, and I feel like a lot of people don't have that analogy they in their head yeah, that of course there's yeah. enough money for all of us to win. All day, man, saying? all so day. That's I for really sure. appreciate you guys, you know, putting me on game to this oh, and... Appreciate yeah, we to appreciate you, guys, you people, bro. You know, dude, it comes it. and like your work speaks for itself, man. Yeah, yeah. And thank you. The, that, that's the one thing that I like. I'm like, dude, we need we need people that. I mean, there goes for anybody listening out there. You need to surround yourself with people that are aiming for the same goal. They're all trying to be better and have them jump on the ride that you're going in and, and keep going in that same direction. Yeah. And being that Cali's a monster with capturing. He got the, to me, in my opinion, he got one of the best eyes in capturing haircuts. Not every videographer can capture a great haircut. And if you look at my academy and you see the footage that he shot, amazing. And then same Thank thing you, with, with uh, Mastermind, like his eye and his photos and all that. Like that's what he's great at. That's what he does. That's how he makes a living. With me, I've learned everything and, and I try to do everything because that's how I make a living. But the one thing that I'm strong on is hair, just like Kelly is too. And if we can get a help, man, with modeling, where well, we could get help with photographers and videographers that 
That'll just make the the, the ride to success smoother, man. Yeah, Quicker and smoother. Bro. And same thing with me, man. I could find sick models and be like, yo, what do you think of this guy? Right. I could find sick photos for inspiration. What do you think of this? And we kind of just blossom off each other. Go back so. and forth. Yeah, yeah. 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 It's a yeah. full circle, bro. Exactly. Okay. So, guys, we want this podcast to last, man. I really do. I could sit here for hours and talk to him and get to know him. But we're going to get straight into action. We're going to get started. We're going to have behind-the-scenes footage. And if you like what you see... Make sure you go to loscutter.com, sign up for the academy. We're going to eventually have videography, uh, photography, haircuts, editorials on everything, and so much more. Make sure you follow Mastermind Photo. Is it photo with P? Uh, photo, with F-O-T-O-O. F-O-T-O-O. Right? So Two Mastermind, yeah. F-O-T-O-O, and obviously Kelly Productions, follow um, K-I-L-I Productions. And then Thank yours you. truly, Los Cut It. And obviously the model marked as marked by Mark since day one. My bad. <laughs> marked since day one. Follow these guys. I'm gonna have all their names on the bottom. So stay tuned. And yeah, stay tuned for this photography shoot. It's gonna be f- fucking phenomenal. You ready? We're gonna fucking kill it, bro. Let's you ready, Kevin? Let's, Let's get, get it, it brother. Right, I'm excited, man. Hey, thank Let's you for joining it. us, brother. Salute. Thank bro. you for having me. Bro. Yep. Yeah. Oof. All right, Hell it's yeah. a wrap. Let's go. Let's go. Peace. Hell yeah. That one's smooth. Yeah. No, no, it's